Welcome back, guys. Welcome back to Phoenix Forest Farm. Uh, yeah, it's raining heavily, guys. Today's not going to be a very pleasant day. I'm just going to have a quick coffee and watch some TV. But you're welcome to some spring onion soup for breakfast if you would like. Tomorrow's weather. It's going to be a beautiful sunny day. Well, that's that's the nice way to start off our day. The spirits are somewhat mildly perturbed today. Luck will not be on your side. Huh. Luck isn't going well for us lately, is it, guys? What do we need? Let's store some weapons. We won't need our pickaxe. It's raining, so we definitely won't need a water can. We will need that side. We need to put it in. Baba, yeah, I'll bring the hole. I'm not, I wasn't sure, but... Oh, who's this? Clint. Oh, hi there. Good morning. Good morning, Clint. I noticed that you've been breaking some rocks open and finding ore. That's good. Yeah, I found two copper ore yesterday. If you want to get the most out of your ore as you find, you'll need a furnace. Just so happens I had an extra set of blueprints lying around here. Here, I want you to have them. Re Thank you, Clint. Thanks very much. I learned how to craft the furnace. The furnace allows you to smelt metal bars. The bars can be used for crafting, construction, and tool upgrades. Tool upgrades, you say? When you've smelted a few copper bars, consider having me upgrade one of your tools. It can make your work a lot easier. Well, okay, I'm heading home. Take it easy. Guys, upgraded tools. That sounds great. Let's let's check out this new quest. Okay, craft the furnace. Easy enough. Visit. Uh, we also have to visit the beach. That won't be today, though, because today you voted to go to the forest. We have to cultivate and harvest the parsnip, which is taking time. And we have to meet everyone around town. We've 13 out of 28 met so far. Let's check out how we craft the furnace. 20 copper ore and 25 stone. The ore could take a while. The stone is easy. You can craft a wooden sign, a stone sign, a text sign. I've never seen that before. And wild seeds. I think we'll check that out in a few days or when we have enough to do it. A campfire. There's no point crafting a campfire today anyway because it's too wet. That mail. I keep finding cool stuff but my backpack is full. Does this sound like you? Well, Pierre's got you covered. Stop by Pierre's general store today. Today? And check out our affordable size 24 backpack. See you soon. Guys, we need that backpack. We do, but we don't have enough. It costs 2000 and we're not even close yet. Okay, look, let's let's just start off by chopping down some weeds. I know it's rainy and no one likes being out in the rain, but it's, it's just, it is what it is, guys. We're going to get soaked today. There's no point. Try not to. But at least we're going to the forest. We'll get some cover from the trees. It would have been a lot worse if you had voted to go to the beach. So, thank you for sparing me. <laughs> sparing me the rain by sending me to the forest today. Guys, how, how did Clint know we had the copper ore? We, f we found it in the village. Oh yeah, well I mean, when we digged it up we were pretty excited. Maybe he heard us. Look. Ah, oh, I thought it was going to be more copper ore. No, well, mixed seeds, we'll definitely take them. Actually, if we... Guys, I think we should plant those mixed seeds. Well, we've five of them now already. Yeah, if we plant them today, we don't need to... We won't need to water them because it's raining. I think we should do that. But if we do, then we're going to have more crops to plant... Or crops to water on non-rainy days. Yeah. Yeah, let's, let's plant them. Just a few more. In this, we need to clear out these rocks someday. A lot of work done. We'll get to it. We'll get to it. It's not a priority at the moment. Just a few more bushes here, then we'll go. We'll go into Cindersnap Forest. Should we start with our usual spot where we get the spring onions? Now, we have a lot of spring onions. We, we'll head there eventually, but I'm not, I'm not too hungry this morning. We, let's go. Oh, yeah, I never checked the sign. Farm, Pelican Town. Okay. What about this house here, though? Nice, you can get in for the rain for a bit. Hello. Who's this? Ah, Mary Luce told me you just arrived. I'm Marnie. Hello, Marnie. It's nice to meet you. I sell livestock and animal care products at my ranch. You should swing by sometime. I'll, I'll do that right now, actually. So she sells hay, heaters, 
milk pail, shears, ornamental hay bale, a dog house, but whoa, look at the price. 10 grand is, is oh man, cat tree, 10,000. 10, so we chose to have a pet cat, but we don't have a jet. Is this how we get the, the, the pet cat? Do we have to buy that cat tree? It's 10 grand, guys. If, if that's the case, we're not going to have a cat for a long time. And animals here, but we can't see what they are, and we need barns or coops. So we can't buy them either. Marnie's house, Marnie's room, I mean. No need to go in there. Shane. Shane's room. We haven't met Shane yet. What's this? It's locked. What about this room? Not good enough friends with Jazz. Oh, that's, yeah, that's the little girl. That's her room there. Okay. Right, back out to the rain. Sorry about this, guys. I know this isn't my farm. You weren't expecting to be out in the rain so much. It's, a, it's, at least we're in the forest. At least we're in the forest and we're not out in the open. But, you know, there's no point hiding from it too much. We are going to get soaked today, no matter what happens, so... Might as well embrace it, I guess. Guys, look at this. We're already up to 50, 50 plus fiber from today alone. Got another dandelion there. Oh, guys, what's... Look at this. What's in here? I'm sensing something ancient. Looks like you'll need an upgraded axe to destroy this neural drought log. Ah, not yet so. Something to consider later on, though. There's there's a an Earl log we we need to get past in the woods. We can't do it yet, but we need to remember it. What was this building here? Can we get in out of the rain for a bit? It's locked. You can hear someone inside though. Creepy guys, creepy. Getting some bad vibes from that place. It's so ominous. Sorry, getting caught in the bushes there. Yeah, let's get rid of these thorny bushes, the rest of them. Yeah, we'll, what will we do? We'll go up around the lake a bit more and then I think we'll come back down around. Yeah, that sounds good. Another mixed seed, lovely. Okay guys, so far we went to the mountains, today we're checking out the beach, or today we're checking out the forest. Two areas still left to explore, and that's the beach and the town. I mean really thoroughly explore the town. We've both of those areas left to, to explore. What's, oh look at that, there's some sort of broken bridge there. Can't cross it yet though. But guys, beach or town tomorrow, that's your decision for this video. Oh, we've got a house here. Can we go in for shelter? No, it looks abandoned. It looks abandoned, but can we still go in and have a look around? If no one's living there. Okay, across this island here. It's starting hidden behind the trees. Any forage? No. Any fibre? Let's take this. A wild horseradish. Is that our first one of them? And spring onions. Six of them today. Maybe more. Six so far, anyway. Anything down around here. Just that big metal gate. Which we can't do anything with. We checked it yesterday. Oh yeah, guys. Since we upgraded the foraging. Um, it should be easier to cut down trees now. It should cost less energy. Let's try it out. On this tree here. Oh, sorry butterflies. Didn't mean to disturb you. Oh, hello. What's this on the wall there? On the cliff side. Only a master of the five ways may enter. Zero out of five. Master of the five ways. Oh, our skills. So the five ways. Farming, mining, foraging, fishing and combat. We have foraging at level one since yesterday. We have to get all these to ten, I think. It'll take a while, but I'm not at all worried about it. There's no doubt we'll get them to level ten. We don't. I don't think we even need to grind. It'll just happen naturally and... I suspect it'll happen quickly enough too. Some more bushes here. That cave there, guys. 
that wasn't there in my last playthrough. So that's brand new. Sorry, when I say my last playthrough, what I mean is any of the times I visited Grandpa's farm back in the day, that cave wasn't there. So it must be new enough. This house here, who's this? It's locked. Oh, Leah's house. Okay, well that's that's okay. We've met Leah anyway, so let's um take a quick detour by town. See if there anyone around. Oh, actually, I don't think they will be. It's raining. Well, look, there's some bushes there, so it wasn't a complete waste of trip. Is there some over here? Did I see some the other day? No. Yeah, there we go. Guys, we've got we've grinded over a hundred fiber today. That's amazing. I don't like. I don't know what we wanted for it, but it's good to have. I'm sure we need it someday. And look, there's something up there. Let's go grab that. Actually, no. Our inventory is nearly full, and our farm is right here. So we'll free up some space, then we'll come back, and we might chop down some trees while we're at it. Okay. We don't need the wood. We don't need the sap. We'll keep that maple seed. Uh, we'll plant them in a minute. Fiber, yeah. Keep the fiber. I think we can sell everything else. Maybe the horseradish. Maybe we'll keep that. Back to the bus station again. What is it? It's a leak. Okay, I'll take a leak. There's another one, yeah. These came in handy during Super Mario Bros. 2, two guys. So they might be handy this game too. A daffodil and a dandelion. Oh, and we have the wild horseradish, guys. Um, the spring re the spring seeds recipe. I think, yeah, I think we should do it. That's a gold quality dandelion, though. Maybe we should keep that. Did we have, did we have, oh, sure, we have one in our inventory. Great. I'd, yeah. Am I missing something? Can we craft them? Do we have one of them? Yeah, we do. Okay, let's go. Let's try it. Okay, not bad. We got it. So we'll sell the leek, we'll sell the spring onions, we'll plant the mixed seeds, and then we'll plant the wild seeds. Okay, let's go. Let's do a bit of digging. Sorry, a bit of hoeing. Guys, what are those strange noises? It's probably the monsters, is it? Do they come out earlier when it rains? Uh, no, there's nine squares. Will we get all these? We will, and we've one left. Okay, another another line down here should, should be enough, will it? Yeah, that should just about do it. Okay, we've ten of them to plant. Guys, the thing the thing with those wild seeds, it costs four items to craft it, but you get ten of them. So it costs four items, you get ten back. Okay, we're just gonna sell those. Yeah. Cost four items, you get ten back. But that sounds like a bargain, but you also have to take into account that you have to water them every day. We'll see how it goes. We'll try it this time. Why not chop down some trees? We still have some energy left and you know what I'm like with chopping down trees. I can't get enough of it. Gotta store up plenty of firewood, guys. It's the only form of light we have in the house. Actually, it isn't. We, we have those magic torches. Still, though, we need, we'll need firewood for winter. And for building stuff. Actually, that reminds me. Robin, she she built she upgrades our house and she builds buildings for us. We haven't checked out her shop yet. We, we went to the mountain yesterday, but her shop was closed on Tuesdays. We should pop by again soon. I won't. Um, there's no need to put that to a vote. We'll do it someday while we're up there anyway. We'll just pop in and have a look and see what she has. Then we can start thinking about what buildings we should build or save up for. The decisions I give you guys, the votes, at the end of every video. It won't be just where we go tomorrow. Eventually they will change. But for now, we're just getting used to the valley. So we're keeping it simple. Where should we go? Okay. 
what do we 70 wood just from clearing out the bus station guys that was good 24 is half two guys you've 100 wood almost 200 fiber i'm happy with that it's only day three that's some that's good going and we built two chests so that would have been 200 wood so it's almost 200 wood and 200 pieces of fiber in just three days Okay, for the, the rest of the day, back out to the rain yet again. Let's see, do we have any intruders? Any sneaky bats want to come and attack me? I have my trusty sight with me. If those bats come at me, I'll chop off their wings and I will sell them. It worked well for us yesterday. Was it... Was it six bat wings we sold and we got... 90 gold? That, that was good. Okay, are the monsters, do the monsters not show up in the rain? Maybe not, okay. That could be something, could be worth noting that, no monsters in the rain. Let's chop some wood, so. There's a few branches lying around that we still need to get to. That we still need to clear. But our yard, it's coming, it's coming along well now, guys. It's just, it, look, don't get me wrong, there's still a lot of rubble, there's still a lot of bushes, there's still a lot of branches and logs. But we've, we've made a lot of progress over the last three days. And considering our, far, our farm gets attacked by monsters, that makes it, you know, a bit more difficult. So we've stocked up on a lot of wood, fibre and cleared out a lot of the farm. This is going well, I think. I think there's one, yeah, one there too. Oh, hello. What's this, guys? Look, new enemy. A slime. Oh, two of them. Oh, I, I can't move. Did, did, did they poison me? Oh, I can move now, okay. Okay, these guys, these aren't too bad. I think these might be easier than the bats, because when you hit the bat, the bat flies off and comes back. These just stand there. Oh, we got a slime. Okay, well, let's sell that and see how much it's worth. And it's 11 p.m. now, guys, so might be time to go to bed. Yeah, it is. If you want some spring onion soup for dinner before you go to bed, no problem. I'm just going to hit the hay. Okay, guys, another day down. <laughs> What do you want to do tomorrow? Will we explore the town or will we go to the beach? Those are your options. Let's uh, let's check it out. Let's check out our two options. So, the town. And we still need to remember, we still need to meet those 28 people. We've only met 13 so far and we haven't met anyone new today. There's no doubt we'll, not, we'll, we'll meet them all over time. And the beach. We haven't been here at all. And remember, we got a letter from Willie. He says he has a gift for us, so we still have to collect it. What's that to start? The museum, the blacksmith. Oh, there's Clint's house. The Georgia Mart. We haven't been there yet. We don't know what's up there. The Mayor's Manor. We haven't seen it. The graveyard. Two Willow Lane. One Willow Lane. S the saloon. The River Road. Trailer. That's... We, we have been there. Harvey's Clinic. We haven't been there. What's it? Community... Oh, that building we seen yesterday, that was locked. That's a community centre, okay. Yeah, guys, there's still a lot of the town left to explore, but we also need to go to the beach. Which will it be? Will you go to the beach or the farm tomorrow? Good night, guys. Have a nice sleep.